Ladies and gents, it's Justin Johnson. And I'm here to set things straight, set an appraisal, set a new precedent for 2024. We'll look to better our well-being and vitality and mental state and financial reasonings. We want to buy things, buy off more than we can chew. We want to eat the king's delicacies. Or we want to look at things that deceive the eyes. The opposites attract, but also that immoral sense that it brings to our, our mental attitude. Our appearance, the way we dress, we need to dress with mildness. How you'd want your partner to dress, not inappropriately, so others can gaze over their treacherously things. <laughs> But anyway, listen to my prayer and this resonate to this scripture. Re resonate to the scripture. Living with authority. 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 Dressing with authority. Being responsible to the relationship. Start having an insecurity feeling on both sides of the fence. Your relationship, your spouse, your partner, your partner in the future. How would you like your partner in the future to dress? respectful. You're going to give your good love and your devotion to somebody. You want them to be respectable as you are. If you be um, dress disrespectful, expect your partner to be dressed inappropriately. Having a mild attitude, your partner should become with a mild attitude too. Taking pride in our responsibilities is very important. Anyway, this prayer that I've written, Jehovah, I'm so glad I've revealed what I'd said. To get these spiritual feelings off my chest. I didn't know how that I could cope. With letting out the zeal of excitement I felt that there was no hope. But as soon as I joined your kingdom, I'd seen all the faces how they enjoyed your freedom but when I was greeted I was so glad that we had meetings and all the smiles that I was receiving which felt like an emotional vibe of joy from you that they were achieving so with all in alignment I asked to inquire for your assignment I said I would like to take all things within my stride and most certainly reflect upon your name with great pride. Now that I'm truly devoted and take heed to your word and that I make sure I noted, I feel though as if I am truly blessed with your salvation. But before that, I befell into desperation. Now I'll fare my way to you, my guide my faith, my hope, my inspiration. And going back on our things, well, we've all got flaws, we've all got sins, haven't we? we've all got cracks, we want to make change. Maybe you want to beat your target or your fitness test, what you got last year, or this year. Or you want to be a nicer person to your parents. Be more hospita hospitable, hospitable to your parents. Not be aggressive. Do more things for them, helping out, or be kinder to your partner. Let them know that you love him or love her, rather than being angered that they're home from they home from work. Or at work, you may be unpleasant to work work with them, maybe bullying them. Your consciousness should know how you know how that feels. Anyway. 1 James chapter 5 verse 16 Therefore openly confess your sins to one another and pray for one another so that you may be healed. A righteous man's supplication has a powerful effect. Pray for each other. Work together. Talk with like-minded people. Appreciate one another. Love one another. Help each other on out. Anyway, Take care, one love.
speaks on 